Hey hello guys it's how to tag simplified back again with another easy tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to actually manage your stock in Shopify for certain products. Now it's a very easy process so let's get straight into it. First thing that you want to do is open up your preferred browser, head down to Shopify and sign into your existing store. Now as you can see here I have two products which are both digital products. Here is one ebook. The inventory is not tracked so I can actually sell this product with no stock. Now here I have a product that has zero in stock so my store can't sell it. Now this is a problem because we want to make money. Now I'm going to show you how to change this, what to do and to what to change it to. Now here you have the stock. Now I have a zero unavailable, zero committed, zero available and zero on hand. Now, if you want to continue selling while you're out of stock so that money can flow in and you can actually send the packages later, simply press continue selling when out of stock and press save. Now, this actually makes sure that the product stays available for the customer. Now, here you have the shop location and the availability of the product. Now, this is for your own stuff. Now, here you have the available units now let's say I have 10 available units. Now here you can adjust by 10. Simply press save and this will automatically change the stock to 10. Now let's say I have a five, uh, five um, products of these 10 products that are actually damaged. Now I'm going to unavailable, select the zero and here you have a damage. Now change this to add inventory, press five save and now we have a five on hand but now the tricky part is we didn't change the available one so here simply change the available adjust press down and set to minus five as a correction as you can see right here save it and that should be it and here you see on hand which is the total inventory that you have laying around and that is uh, damaged um, that's available that's the overall product now here you have the committed items and that's the fulfilled or the unfulfilled orders for this certain item now you can actually change the quality control uh, safety stock and other stuff uh, here you have the on hand item and if you want to change the availability simply change that now here you simply save all these options and that should be about it if you still get any questions relating to the stock of your item please leave it in the comments down below i'll try my very best to help you if this tutorial has helped you please leave a like and subscribe this helps me out a lot and thank you for watching